This is Richard Von Dyke wasting time with the rest of the Western Hemisphere on my keyboard playing Pac-Man. Dateline reality. In primary elections this week, Arlen Specter lost in Pennsylvania and Rand Paul won in Kentucky. Arlen Specter's loss seems to have ended a 30-year political career. Rand Paul's win seems to have launched a 30-day political career. Paul immediately got in trouble over statements that private businesses should be allowed to discriminate. Fortunately for Rand Paul, voters in Kentucky were evidently not very discriminating. Dateline, the Gulf of Texaco. Today, Rand Paul responded to the Gulf oil spill by saying, quote, Sometimes accidents happen. Uh, memo to Rand Paul, Accidents happen is what you tell a preschooler to make them feel a little better when they crap in their pants. Not what you tell an international corporation when it craps on your coastline. Dateline M-I-S-S-I-S-S-I-P-P-I. In an effort to encourage tourism during the oil spill disaster, officials in Mississippi are offering $75 gasoline gift cards to visitors who book a two-night stay at a hotel on the Gulf. If tourists are unable to find a gas station, they're free to fill their tank with any oil they can scrape off a pelican. Here's exclusive audio of Lindsay Lohan throwing a fit. Finally, Dateline, Down Under. <laughs> Tom Collitz, guitarist for the band Tokyo Hotel, experienced blurred vision and splitting headaches for two days after taking too much Viagra. A band spokesman says Collitz is currently resting comfortably, presumably on his back. <laughs> Nuts, I gotta start over. This is Richard Thorndike going back to the keyboard for BS News. <laughs> You like the crap the pants one, huh? <laughs> I'll, I'll say this. Rand Paul spewed out so much bizarre stuff uh, that I got to give kudos to George Stephanopoulos this morning for not letting his jaw drop right there on the table in the middle of the morning. I mean, you would think that when the camera went back to George Stephanopoulos, to you know, he, he would have the hands like uh, on the side of the face there, like uh, Macaulay Culkin in uh, Home Alone. Like It's just like stunning listening to this guy and all of them. They say stuff. Then you ask them why they believe what they said, and they say, who said that? It's like my mother, the first time she ever smoked the pot. Who's there? I mean, it's totally ridiculous. It's totally, totally, totally ridiculous.